Mission Workshop and Boston Company Tracksmith teamed up to make a very cool collaboration pack. And we got it. of Mission Workshop Reviews, where I buy and test all the gears so you don't have to. And today I am really excited to get my hands on the first batch of a brand new collaboration from Boston Running Company, Tracksmith, and of course, Mission Workshop. And at first blush, this may look like an updated Hauser. Um, but we're going to take a closer look in this bag and we're going to see that it's actually not exactly that. And in fact, I would even say this is for a different set of person, um, that'd be interested in this pack. So don't think of this as a Hauser replacement. So first off, a little bit about Tracksmith. They're from Boston and their whole philosophy is the competitive non-professional runner. So apparently uh, there's bike to work, which is a community that I'm a part of, but there's also run to work. Although I will say this does also work for, for bike to work. So uh, rest assured, you can still pick this up. Um, I love the Hauser and I did a review of the Hauser. You could check that out here. Um, the Hauser for me is really excels on camping trips. Uh, it also is bike to work as well, but the run commute pack really excels for the commuter because it's larger. This is an 18 liter bag. So this is almost as big as say, a, you know, a typical, you know, 20 liter R6, okay? So we're only two liters shy of a typical Mission Workshop bag, but it's not nearly as big uh, on your back, which is which is nice if you're really going to be sweating to work. Anyway, these extra four liters really allow you uh, to pack in more gear. Um, another difference, of course, is this only is a roll down bag. It's not strapped down like the Hauser. Um, and a really cool thing about this, kind of uh, with its run to work pedigree, is it comes with a spec. Now this is a small spec, so I have I have a MacBook Air here and it fits it fits that perfectly. Um, and actually, I never did a review on a spec, so I'm gonna do a separate review on this. So if you haven't subscribed, please do hit the bell icon so you'll get a notification when I do uh, my spec review and all the other reviews. Anyway, the spec is really cool. And it's interesting, you, you, you tuck it in like this, the flap actually, and then that's how the bag, or the computer, stays in and it has a little tab. Anyway, more on that um, on, my, on my spec review. But yeah, so this is for bringing your computer to work, right? Um, now, it doesn't have a lot of pockets, unlike the Hauser. The Hauser has three extra zippered pockets, which are awesome but remember the hauser comes with a tool roll this is really for like mountain biking and camping you're not going to need like all this external um pockets with your biking or running to work but you do have a little snack pack here this is like a very typical um pocket here you could just put snacks it doesn't go all too deep also you know i'd be remiss to point out this thing has amazing reflection. So this is kind of Tracksmith's logo. This this cross reflection appears on a lot of their material, uh, a lot of their products. And if you haven't uh, seen their website, I implore you to check them out. They're doing a, a whole new uh, capsule called the Run Commute Capsule, in which this bag is a part of it. Link in the description. Um, they also have some Tracksmith uh, logos here. Um, anyway, so another difference between the run commute pack and the hauser is while they are both hydration packs more on that in a second um in lieu of all these extra little zippered pockets for tools and stuff that the hauser has it has mesh pockets on each side for a water bottle so we're just going to take um a mirror mission workshop water bottle that i just happen to have and we'll just 
pop that in. Okay, so this is obviously for folks who uh, maybe don't want to use the hydration pack. Maybe three liter uh, hydration pack is not something that you need uh, for your commute, just a water bottle or two. So another difference, and this is gonna be a little hard to show, it wasn't on Mission Workshop's website, it wasn't on Tracksmith's website, so this is the first time we're gonna be looking inside of a run commute pack on the internet. That's why y'all subscribe, right? Inside here is a separate little slide, right? A little pocket that you can put uh, documents or folders and additionally there is a zippered um, or not zippered but there's a, an extra mesh pocket on top I really it is so hard to see in this bag that is why probably uh, I mean it's easy to see in the bag if you own it right like oh there it is but <laughs> for showing on camera but but trust me it's in there there's a, so you have two organizational pockets within here for documents or for delicates like USB drives or something like that. So they kind of stay in place. And then when you stuff your clothes in there, they're not gonna like be all jiggling around. So it definitely is made for work, the work commuter. So we're gonna close this back up and then I'm gonna show you the hydration pocket. So it's exactly like the Hauser in this respect, okay? You're gonna have a side, completely separate zipper. And just so you know, um, this bag does have an internal sheet frame, okay? And when you order in this bag on Mission Workshop, you can also, you know, save on shipping. You can pick up a, a Hydra pack or a Camel pack. This is a three liter one. And I'm not gonna do it all here, keep this video short, but basically, yeah. You put the pack, you put the hydration pack here, zip this up. This tube strings through a little, there's a little hidden channel in here. So it slides through. So you're, you're completely sealed and zippered off. Um, and then you could attach it on this strap or this strap. So the, the, the perforated back and the, and the straps are the same, just like the Hauser. Um, it has a detachable um, belt buckle you don't need to use that it has uh detachable sternum straps so if you don't want that you can you can get rid of all these things um and another nice touch that the hauser doesn't have um is it has these elastic loops to keep these straps from flapping around so that's really nice yeah so um this comes in at 238 dollars so it's a little bit more than the 14 liter hauser which is at 220 and this only comes in this one navy blue and it's 500d cordura um that latest iteration of the housers are coming in uh with ht 500 um although i i have a wax canvas uh hauser um from a collaboration that mission workshop did with uh Taylor Stitch. However, this hydration pack is with you get a you get a, a custom uh, tag. That's a Tracksmith's logo. So I don't know. I guess my hydration packs. I'm always getting collaborations. I love collaborations. Vision Workshop. Keep it up. So um, yeah, that's basically it. Uh, so if you order this now, uh, it's they're doing another round of pre-orders. I got this. This was the first pre-order. Uh, it shipped September 22nd, 2020. So if you order now, uh, it's still available. The next batch is going to be shipped out October 12th. Um, super great bag. Really like it. Beautiful colors. Love the reflective hits. Really love the focus. More work-related. Hauser definitely is more mountain bike camping related. Um, it's a bigger bag. So um, we're gonna do some quick fit picks just to see how this guy looks on me and uh, help you see if you like it. All right, everyone, thanks for watching. And again, this is Mission Workshop Run Commute. 
And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, I don't know what you're waiting for. This is the only channel on YouTube that's exclusively Mission Workshop. I'm putting out new videos as frequently as I can. Hit that subscribe button right there. Check out the other channel's videos. We have over 125 videos at this point. Drop a comment below about this bag or really anything Mission Workshop related. And I'll get back to you and I'll see you guys real soon.